Hi, this is Christina. Thanks for joining me. I am One Scrappy Scrapper, and this is week four of our Halloween collaboration with uh, Mandy's Place. And um, we were to do two projects for this week, and I did film a video on how to make these. It cut off, so I'm going to see. <laughs> I'm not very savvy about all this business, but... I'm going to try and see if I can, uh, like clip in the video or maybe do like a part one, part two. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, I did show how to make these and we ended off the video with me just tying a knot and then we'll just give it a little haircut on the ends. Okay, all right. And there's our little broom. Now we can sweep up our little bits. No, just kidding. Anyway, um, you could add a little embellishment or something. I have some little spiders somewhere that I want to throw on there. So that is one project that I have made for this week. The second... Um, yes, I made some treat bags and pouches and things of that nature. So here I have a couple pillow boxes that I have made and embellished. And, um, the recipient, I put sticky tape on them and decorated them so that the re so I can mail them flat, obviously, because some of these embellishments are pretty thick and, you know, I think it will be just be easier so they don't get smushed either in transit. So all you have to do is basically just take the sticky tape off, stick them together. I mean, most people know how to put a pillow box together. Okay. So I stamped out and punched out this image and I made a little rosette with a cupcake liner, punched out a little circle and then glued on the acrylic or spider, did some cray paper and that's that. This one I have cray paper and ribbon and a little spider. <clears throat> Our, there we go. Now I have these little treat bags that I made and I die cut a little window, added this little ghost. I stamped on the background and added a little ribbon. I figured I was generous with the ribbon so that if they need to take it off and add a, some of them I have added, um, just little tickets onto or, um, oh my goodness, I lost it. Anyway, um, tags, uh, made this little rosette embellishment. This is a punch that I have. And this little bag is a lifestyle crafts bag that I've had in my stash. Oh, the pillow box was a uh, Momenta, I believe. Now, these guys are from the Stampin' Up treat bag. So I have made these and decorated these, and I did add, I, oh, I distressed the others, and I got a little crazy, I guess, with the ink, but. Added some fun stuff on there. <coughs> Excuse me. Here we have another little treat bag that I added a little rosette and a little bat, some ribbon, some little bling. Most of the projects that I've showed previously, I have added more to. So next week I probably will show 
all of my completed projects along with um, what I'm going to make next week and how I'm going to put it all together. That's my plan. Okay, and here, lastly, I put these little treat bags together. And what I've done is I put ribbon on and a little tag. So when the person gets this, they can just remove this sticky tape and then put the box together, lining up the edges, and then folding this over. They should just meet right up. All right. This is a die from Sizzix. It's a little gable box. So there's that. And then I'll just put the bottom together, <clears throat> run the ribbon through, and there's your tree box. Okay, so I've made four different versions of those that I can, I just decorated the front of all these and added adhesive to all of them and embellishments. And then we have this little guy with the spider. And I stamped out spider web in the background and then added some of the paper. And here, I really like this one. This one's fun. I mean, I think they're all fun, but um, I still need to add, I think, a couple of rhinestones and, you know, jazz them up a little But For the most part, I really like how most of these came out. Okay, so there we have it. That is what I have done for week three for Mandy's Place. Thanks for stopping by. Try and check out everyone else's wares for this week this is week four we only have one week left and thank you for all my new subscribers and thank you to everyone who has stopped by and seen and checked out and have seen what i've made so stop back again thank you bye